bots are you freaking ready to go live? Yes, from, from my, yeah, I know, my bad. That's from my, uh, from my basement, well, boxing in my basement, but, yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> Welcome, everybody. Welcome to Anime Talk with Oldish, episode 46. Um, yeah, so we're here to talk some anime because it's been a while. Been a while. I I'm a little out of it. I'm pretty tired. Uh, work's been busy. All right, it's been busy. Um, but we haven't talked to anime. So our last episode, we talked about, um, yeah, yeah, we did the, sp yeah, we did the spooky episode. So, and then the next week or last week, I should say, um, we didn't do an episode. I wasn't feeling so good. Um, yeah, sorry, sorry. But yeah, I just wasn't feeling. Good. I went to bed super early uh, on that night. I just passed out. Um. So yeah, we got some anime pretty much to talk. I mean, it's pretty much just going to be an update of our fall anime watch list. Um, whatever we've been working on and stuff like that. Like, I'm still... I think I'm almost caught up in all my series now. I might be... I, I didn't watch Golden Kamui tonight, so I, I, I don't have that. Yeah, we'll get, we'll get talking about that here. Also, let's say I hope you all had an awesome Halloween. Yeah, I, I I ate I ate seven layer dip and cookies. Oh, we we don't have any, so yeah, and just where we live, it's not really neighborhood, but. We weren't trick or treating, so <laughs> we stayed home. No, uh, we played Candyland, and my son won most of the candy. So, nope, it was intense, dude. He kept beating me. Um, but yeah. Otherwise, uh, I did watch some anime this weekend. Hopefully, you guys watched Soul Eater because it's like the perfect uh, Halloween anime. Um, but I did watch something actually brand new that that's actually. Well, I think it just came out on DVD. Um, I watched the new My Hero movie. Did you watch that yet, Box? It starts with an S. It's the white hair guy with the... Uh, I don't know, it's got like the biotech in his back or whatever. I don't know what do you call it. Yeah, the newest one. It's the newest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that one. It starts with the S, but I can't remember his name. I think it's like Zet. Yeah, yeah, seven. Yeah, Steve. Um. But no, yeah, did I watch. Did you watch it? Oh, okay. Um. It's a, it's a pretty good movie. It's uh, I got a lot of questions though. Um. I don't know if it's just my hero pulling a DBZ or what, but I got some questions for that final fight. Oh, spoilers! Spoilers! Because it, it just came out on DVD. So it's still pretty new. Because uh, not many people got the. I don't think too many people got to see it in theaters. But we'll do a spoiler warning if you haven't watched it and you want to watch it. We'll talk about spoilers now. All right, go ahead. Spoil away. Yeah, so you know about the like the blood fusion thing, right? Yeah, dude, I I think they kind of pulled this out of their ass. All right, I'm just saying that. Um, not trying to hate, but I'm just really confused by it because. Well, my problem is not even that. It's just like, how did Baka go handle all for one? He's never had it before. And he's just like, I could just go 100, no problem, you know. 
Like he went one hundred. Like Deku's been working at it forever. It was. It was. It was a DBZ moment, man. It was just like, like this. Uh, you know, like when Goku fights Jiren, like it just like, yeah, Ultra Instinct. I spirit bomb myself. Who would ever known that I could get a huge power up for spirit bombing myself? Anyways, um, it's a DBZ moment. Overall, yes, I still enjoyed the movie though. I saw the animation was beautiful, everything. Logic wise, I didn't think it made sense, but whatever, it's anime. <laughs> so I just, I just like, I, I was like, eh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that. Oh, it's almost like you should wait though, because every year they come up with a volume pack that has all of them. No, 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 I know, but like if you just like wait like a few seasons and like, like oh, I can get all nine for the same price as one. <laughs> so I know I think I bought, I think I bought that version too of Ruby. Um. But yeah, so I watched the movie. I thought it was really, I thought it was good. I really did. Uh, the animation was great, everything. Uh, the thing that I really liked about the movie is they, they used everybody. Like, everybody had a fight in this movie, and I thought that was cool. Chimera fight. Which one's that? Oh, yeah. The Digimon. I call them a Digimon. They reminded me of a Digimon. But, I mean, the way he got defeated, too, I was a little surprised. Because that... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, icy hot there. Froze him. I mean, I see that how that works. It's just, like, they... They were like, hold, I don't know, I just feel like, because he was like ridiculously strong and he was just destroying him. And then he kind of had a like standstill moment. And maybe I'm just being too picky, but I don't know. The guy, I was like, holy crap, like this guy would give uh, All Might a challenge, is how I felt, how strong this guy was. I was like, oh man, he, I almost felt like he was stronger than the, the main villain. Obviously, until the end, when I seen what the main villain could do. But, but at first I was like, holy shit, this guy's pretty damn strong. Um, no, it's, it's a good movie. I, I, I would, it's definitely worth watching. And this feels more a continuation after the season. Oh, yeah, yeah, next year. But, like, you know, like, the first movie was, like, a mission uh like a between the first one was between i don't remember what season but you know it's like a between movie this one was like a continuation after this the the season i think i don't know because deku had his uh 100 hair thing and yeah and i i was like i told my wife i was like so what was the point of the girl if deku's just going 100 percent right now I, I, I'm kind of curious. Did he ever go 100% before this? I asked my wife. Like, before. By himself. Did he ever go 100%? The, the muscle dude? That's what my wife thinks. The body dude. Was it 100%? Because I don't remember. Yeah, he did there. I'm saying without the girl. Did he ever go 100%? He did? Okay. I didn't remember, so I was just kind of curious because... Yeah, because I was just wondering because he went 100% in this, and I'm like... Okay. That was like a couple years ago, so I, I didn't remember because I haven't, I haven't rewatched My Hero. I probably... 
Yeah, I probably should rewatch because I'm gonna forget some. Um, but no, I was kind of curious because I'm like, okay, he's just going 100 percent like nothing. It's got and I got like the Super Saiyan hair going on, which I thought was funny. <laughs> but I don't know. I enjoyed it. I'm not gonna be too picky. I did, that was just my only like. I was just thinking. I'm like. Huh, pulling some DBZ stuff here, like, and then they don't, and then, uh, Bakugo doesn't even remember having, uh, one for all. They're like, eh, just forget, just forget about it. <laughs> I didn't give it to Bakugo. Eh. I don't know, man, it was just, it was weird. Unless you're all for one. Uh, yeah, I don't know. And then my question is, what, couldn't Bakugo give it back to Deku? Is that allowed? What's the rules? Yeah, so you could pass it on from eating hair and, I guess, blood fusion. I thought they were, I, I thought they were using the fusion technique. That's what I thought. To beat this guy. <laughs> yeah. Well, they touch figures. I was like, wait. What's up, old man? Talking about anime? Yes, zero, yes. We're talking about the new My Hero movie. I, I watched it, yes, yeah, yesterday. Last night, I watched it. Um, what are you up to, zero? Yeah, so, I don't know, man. I thought it was a good movie. Animation was good. Music was good. It was pretty cool. Have you watched the the movie Zero? I I'm just we were talking about. I'm just really confused at the ending with the whole. Uh, finish my stream. Uh, play perfect. Uh, nice. Oh, you saw you saw the movie, the new one. I I was just really confused with the whole uh, transformation and how Bakugo could control. Um, one for all. I just, I was just weird. It was just weird. The guy, the guy's, the guy's never had it before. <laughs> you know, we've seen how, ever it's a reset, I'm pretty sure. Well, it's not that, it's just that, I'm, I'm confused how Bakugo could control it with, like, no, like, no problem. Like, he was just powering up to 100%, and Deku took years, well, not years, maybe one year. Is it a year yet? I don't even know. But took months. Had, well, he did. How long did he do training? He did tra a lot of training at the beginning to get into the school. But anyways, it, it took it took a while for De Deku. But Bakugo is just like YOLO. And that was just like that was just like an exception thing. Like I don't know. Deku in the first movie does the same thing pretty much. No, because Deku didn't go 100%, though, with One for All. Bakugo did go 100%. They were both at 100% with their Super Saiyan hair. Complete 100%. And then he was in 100% for, like, I don't know, for, what, a minute or two? When they were all fighting? Before he blew up his arms? I don't know. It just, it was just a strange coincidence. I was just, I was like, I don't know. I feel like this is a DBZ moment. Bakugo is just that strong. I guess, dude. Screw it, dude. YOLO. Bakugo, number one hero, man. I, I just thought it was a DBZ moment. I don't know. That's my, that's my gripe about it. I enjoyed it, though. I'm not going to lie. I just, the whole... And then I asked, like, can, can, can Bak, if Bakugo had one for all, couldn't he just give it back to Deku? Or is that not allowed? How does that work? I mean, what if Bakugo just, like, ripped one of his hairs and, and Deku ate it and pinched his butt cheeks again and got the power? I'm, I, I mean, is, does it, can it happen? I'm just, I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, because the, the the thing was is when uh, All Might gave it to Deku, he had to eat his hair, right? And he's like, make sure you pinch your butt cheeks. 
<laughs> so that's what All Might said to him. So that's why I was wondering. I was like, what if... Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. No, it's pretty much just like, who's ever courageous, right? Like, who's the true definition of a hero? You can't hear box, by the way? Oh, it feels bad, dude. I forgot to unmute you, dude. We've been talking you, this whole time. Did you? You fuck. <laughs> Solo episode, guys. I'm just here for box to uh tell me what to say what the, i fucking told you before we started <laughs> to unmute me i told you i'm not awake dude i'm not professional feels bad man we just went like 10 minutes too yeah and ah, who cares about box's opinion <laughs> oof so i've been talking for the last 10 minutes for uh, fucking no reason <laughs> now it's your turn to talk box go ahead no you fucking ruined the moment now <laughs> I'm sorry, man. That's my Dude, bad. I fucking even told you before we went on live to make I... sure you unmuted me. Dude, I'm not awake, all right? My bad. That's not an excuse. It is to me. I... Um... <laughs> sorry, oh guys. God, we, I... we, we talked about I'm it. I'm done. This episode's over. I'm out of here. All right, man. You were never here anyway, so that's good. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, I already just, said my two cents. Up. I don't feel like re-saying it. Just say it again. Say it all. Well, pretty much all I said was uh, the ending made no sense. The whole transfer thing made no sense. And all I've seen from that is just the fights. I didn't actually see the whole yeah, movie. Yeah, you didn't see the whole movie. But can we go on to something else? Yes, Since you yes. Well, yeah. muted me we for the last that. 17 minutes. It's all right, man. It's just, you know, just muted. Solo you. episode, I guess. You wanted, the, you wanted that 17 minute base um... solo? Okay, so what else have you watched, Box? Because I want to go out, because you said you haven't been watching too much anime. He's been yeah, busy, guys. neither have you, because you've been, like, sleeping no. and No, dude, I'm, watch, I'm and... keeping up with most of my... Most I've just been watching the most of the usual stuff, but the other stuff I've been watching is... I finally started watching Jujutsu Kaisu. Kaisu. Yeah, did you finish the first episode? No, I'm, like, right at the end. Yeah, what are you thinking about it? What do you think so far? I... I'm presuming you're going to explain more about the curses. What, and what part are you in? The first episode about like almost 12, 19 minutes. Yeah, yeah, no, like what's happening right now in the anime? Uh, like the moment. On the at. end. Is it really uh, close the it? main character just punched the weird curse in the head, retrieving his two friends. That was the last yeah. thing I saw. And then the weird curse thing just died. Uh, From so other dude with the weird wolf a bit finger then? Huh? You seen him eat the finger? No, I'm presuming that's coming up. Oh, well, spoiler. Uh, wow. So, hey, how far? What? What's the time in that episode? It's a total of 23 minutes and 55 yeah, seconds. You, I'm where at. Where you at? 1905. Yeah. You should have seen that then. It didn't show me eating so no finger. Yeah, he gains the power, right? Or maybe I'm mixing up episodes. Maybe You're like two episodes. behind, like, it's at 1950 when he grabs the finger and eats it. Oh, what's well, like right there? No, Jujutsu Kaisen is really good. Really I, I, it's good. interesting. The main character seems kind of like a troll. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like all three, actually. I think it's a really good... I'm also uh, behind... Well, I'm also a little bit behind on... I'm standing on a million lines. That's the other thing I've been watching. Oh, okay. I kind of gave up on Fire Force. It just has not been entertaining anymore. Um. Well, let me... Okay, let's 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 hold it back here. Hold it back. All right, Jujutsu Kaisen. I just want to say, since Box is starting it finally, I'm happy that he is. Dude, I've been I trying to switch loving. jobs and, like, figuring that shit yeah, out. Yeah, well, we understand. I'm just saying I'm just happy you're starting it. I'm loving it. I, it's, it's interesting, but I, I'm guessing it's going to explain more once I keep watching. Oh, yeah, for sure. It's one episode, dude. Um, I love the first three characters. I like the, the main squad. I, I do like... I think my favorite guy still, though, is the guy with the blindfold. I think he's really oh, cool. Oh, everyone's calling him the, 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 the other Kakashi. The other Kakashi. Um, <laughs> yeah. I, I'm, yeah. So far, I'm liking yeah, the, the wolf I mean, guy. Yeah, with, yeah kind of. But... I don't know. He's very cool so far. I love uh, the I ending like the... song. 
The ending animation is badass. I kind of like the opening for this show. Nah, he isn't as cool as Kakashi. I don't know, man. I only watched five episodes, so... Gotta give him time. I, I imagine he's gonna be pretty badass if he can fight... Uh, if he can fight the main power of what's uh, in... The, the curse guy in uh, What's-His-Face, the main character. Can't think of his name right now. Kakashi was badass in the first episode you met. Met you? Yeah, I mean, I mean, Kakashi's my favorite in Naruto, but... This guy was pretty cool, too. This guy was pretty cool, too. Or he could be, like... Conqueror in Boruto. He finally did it. He finally did it. <laughs> um, but no, I like Jujutsu Kaisen. I, it gave me okay. So episode four gave me that hunter x hunter vibe when uh uh when Gon and Killa. I, I don't and, know if uh, you watched any. Hit to hang on. Let me. I got fit. Let me. Uh, well, I was trying to answer Zero's question. Oh, we'll get her here in a second. Um, it gave me that you know when uh, is it Pito? Is it the cat lady when she first gets summoned? Pito. Yeah, and they, it's that oh shit moment. I had that a little bit with episode four. I was like, oh fuck, dude. <laughs> like, like, oh. It got, it got yeah, my goal is at least get through the first two episodes of that tonight. Yeah, it's really good. Like, Since I've. Well, I probably was going to probably watch it up until like. But yeah, I love Jujutsu. Probably the fifth. Yeah, it's just a cool. It's cool. It's got, the, it's got the really good, like, long anime, like, what you want from a long anime. It's got a really good start to it. I'm really intrigued by the world. Just a conquer and then Zero has laughing emote. Yeah. Have you seen Boruto? Because he's he finally did what he said he was going to do one time. It was uh, kind of funny. I haven't watched any Boruto. So they, they're fighting puppets and conquer was doing his puppet thing. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Well, just kind of spoilers. Spoilers, Boruto. Fan. I'm way behind and I'll probably forget it by the time. Well, it's I'm not really it. that important because he's not really been in the show besides like this part. Well, yeah, besides a few other parts. He finally, you know, did the whole. Uh, Baboomba thing, like his one sing- other signature move besides Iron Maiden, he blew himself up, <laughs> fighting other pup another puppet master. Oh, all right, because <laughs> they're protecting something, which is a spoiler. Oh, oh, he finally did his other something. secret move. <laughs> okay, okay. I I still don't like Boruto. That's all right. If you, it's okay if you like Boruto, man. You can like but Boruto. But the character I liked, why did he have to baboomba himself with his yeah. puppets? There's nothing wrong. I mean, everyone has different ta- tastes. Maybe. No, like, I mean, I watch it, but, like, I only care about when they show the characters from the old series. Yeah, I don't care too. about the three the three youngins. That's fine. Uh, <sighs> no, I haven't watched it. I plan on watching it, but that's, like, way down the line. Just a quick fact about Jujutsu Kaisen, which uh, I did see on the internet. That uh, with only four episodes that came out, I know there's five out right now, but this is when I read it. Only four episodes of Jujutsu Kaisen. It's our the manga sales already caught up to I think Black Clover, which is kind of ridiculous. So I'm thinking Jujutsu Kaisen could be the next Demon Slayer, just hype wise. I'm just counting like the hype wise of it. I, I could see it becoming. Uh, what what Demon Slayer was, and kind of my hero. I put my hero in that category too, just going off of hype levels. I feel the like hype Jujutsu train. Kaisen, but I would say Jujutsu Kaisen right now. Is, I don't know. Like Demon Slayer is still a good first season. I think it's still a little bit overhyped for the first season. That's just my feeling on it. Um, my hero, I'd say. They hyped Demon Slayer way too up, so that's why I didn't watch it at first. Yeah. Okay. I got a question though. Do you like Demon Slayer Season 1 more than My Hero Season 1? Yes. Okay. Because it was, you know, not Deku crying for, like, at least there was no Deku crying for, like, five minutes. Yeah, but, I mean, My Hero was was good, too, the first season. Plus, they have a... Um, was it was it Inosuke? But I would agree, Demon Slayer, I would say, just first season-wise, is better. Um, but I still think overall, I think like I always, I've been saying this, like Demon Slayer is good, but I don't think it's amazing. Not yet. At least what we've seen, it could change. I haven't watched the movie yet. So I haven't watched the train movie, but we'll see. 
I'm just saying, mm-hmm. I, I'm trying to think, because I'm thinking right now, out of five episodes, I'm really liking Jujutsu Kaisen a lot, out of the first five episodes. Have you been... So, it could be in the lead, maybe. But we have to see... Yeah, I gotta half. watch more to give more of an opinion on this. Well, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta see the second half. But like when the first season is completely done, I'll tell you which one I probably like the most out of the three. Anyways, we'll move on from that. Um, uh, I'm like saying? one episode. Huh? What were you saying? What was your next one? Oh, I'm like a little bit behind on like episode or two. Yeah, I'm on episode three. I. I'm still on episode three of I'm Standing on a Million Limbs. What the hell, man? I, I, I started watching it, and then I went to like do something else, and then I completely forgot about finishing it. Dude, it's good. I like it, actually. I, I like I'm Standing on a Million Limbs. Um, oh, no, I'm on episode four, actually. I've seen episode three. Never mind. What did you see last? Uh, they got that new female companion who's the wizard. Yo, did I, got, I see four? I got a theory about this show, too, man. It's just gonna be a harem. No, 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 no. Um. So like, everyone. Okay, so every person they've gone so far in this show. Yeah. They've all had like a terrible past, like event. All. Is this gonna be one of them sad animes? Uh, I think it's gonna be kind of like a like a redemption kind of thing. But like, there's like. Like, all of them so far, like, the blonde hair. Well, I'm trying to not spoil for you, but I think her episode comes up. Maybe it was the last one. It was the last one. That was the Help Me episode. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, like, we've seen her pass with, like, the uh, mom or whatever. And then we've seen the four, um, or the new girls, uh, the wizard girl there. The, the fire thing. mage. Uh, yeah. We said her past and what <laughs> happened. Best to her. ability can just make her one more warm. Yeah, and then the sword girl has like a uh, disease or something like it's that. It's like a muscle her... disease yeah. where she can't really. Do I don't know much if disease or, like, is walk. the right word because I don't remember exactly what it is. But it, okay, let's say sickness because I don't know if it's actual disease, but there's some kind of sickness uh, that she has that makes her weaker. And then the main guy. It's kind of funny because. They have these pa- like these dark like pasts, but he the ma- the main character he just hates, plays games. He hates the real life world, and he's loving the video game world. So he's kind of the complete opposite, at least for right now, because we don't really know what truly his past yet. Um, but I do like it. Uh, did you meet the sword girl, the the one that trains them? No, that's that's the episode I'm on right oh, now. Okay. Which is episode Dude, four. She's pretty ridiculous. <laughs> Um, uh, but have you, you I met have, her at the end, right? I think of episode four. No, no, I, where he trains uh, the main guy. It's just no, funny because that, uh, that's the one. Yeah, that's episode four. That's the episode I'm on. They don't get trained until like later in that episode. I think. Oh, okay. I thought, I thought they finished four. But anyway, no, this is I funny because she likes training him because she had she's one of those characters that likes fighting a lot like she likes slicing <laughs> and so she's happy because they can respawn and so she can cut them up anytime she wants so it's like this Excellent. terrible the show's pretty funny i'm not gonna lie it actually has pretty good comedy in it she's like hey you can't die slicing dice uh, yeah yeah she's just really happy and excited and they're like that's creepy <laughs> have you watched any more that uh imiyasha spin off yep i'm i'm all the way cut up Oh, I, I completely forgot about it. No, no, I'm I've sti- been watching it. I've been like, I'm it. still. I only finished the first episode. I, I've been rewatching Inuyasha when I go to bed, so I can nice. like kind of remember what the hell's going on, and all these characters and stuff. So, it's uh, so the fun things. I, I, that that's another thing I have to catch up on. Is that I, I oh, really like Inuyasha's daughter in this one so far. My favorite character. Okay, like I don't care if it's a spoiler, but which one is his kid? The red one. The red clothes. Okay, then who who red are the other two? That's Shishomaru's. Both of them the twins. Yep. Oh, because I'm pursuing. Uh, yeah, like hair. when I when I when they first saw, her, I'm like I'm pursuing the one that looks exactly like, you know, wearing the the bow is Imiyasha's kid because she's not what we call the brightest. Um. Uh, no, she's really cool. She's really funny. Um. 
But yeah, it's, it's like, kind of crazy too because she is what a quarter demon and at least a quarter. She's half and half. Uh, she's well, half demon, half human. No, no, she's a quarter. Because Inuyasha was a half. Oh yeah. Yeah, remember. I don't know how much spirit she has, but in the, la the latest episode, they did say that she was a quarter, but she also is, because uh, from Kagome, Kagome, um, she gets the spirit too. She's like, she can use spirit abilities as well. So, uh, we did. Yeah, get to I, see... I completely forgot about it, and it's just like I should probably watch that. I, I can see where it's building up too, so I'm kind of excited so... to see where it goes. What's that? I thought like in the first episode it showed like the twins get separated. Yeah. Um they do get like separated. In the, in the past. Yeah. They do. She, uh, I, uh, I like I got all, I completely forgot about it, so like I have to the silver hair watching. girl gets sent to the real world and lives with uh Kagome's... Yeah, what's that kid's name? It's they're related to Kagome. Oh, oh, but he's a he's an adult now, and he he. Oh, his, is that his brother? Her brother? Uh, yeah, I don't know if it's brother, but like it's it's one of the family members. I think it's his cousin. Because the old man is his... still there too. <laughs> yeah, how is he still? Alive? He's still like, alive, dude. Yeah, how is he still well, alive? If I remember correctly, from anyone, the the time is way different in that world than the real world. Oh, so. Except for that kid, the kid is grown up, so it's definitely like been like a few years, but not yeah. like too long. So I, I think the time thing's a little weird. I, I don't know. I, I had to watch it because like at first it was not making sense, but well, any watch his daughter. Started... I, th I can't remember how old she said. She's pretty old though. So I'm really curious where any watch is and Kagome is and stuff like that. I'm presuming they eventually will show the old characters. Again? Yeah, I mean, they kind of sh they kind of spoilers. They kind of showed Shomaru. He's gonna, I feel like he's gonna be playing a big part because there's something that uh, they kind of like showed the future of what could happen, like what they're gonna have to face, kind of thing. Oh. Um, and it has to deal with Shomaru. So, um, but yeah, I'm kind of curious to see where it goes. I, I like it. Yeah. It's pretty cool. It's I, I forgot cool. The, about this anime, so I like have to rewatch it. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's kind of fun so far. I've been enjoying it. Uh, um, I think the last thing I, I've only seen, like, the first episode was uh, the, what you call it? The Dragon Quest. There we go. That's what I was saying. No, the Dragon I'm, Quest. Yeah, I'm anyway. down on Dragon Quest. Me and my son got a couple episodes. Well. Yeah, I'm way behind. I only got the first episode in. I'm like two or three episodes behind Dragon Quest. Um... Dragon Quest, the adventure die. Yeah. But yeah, uh, you were saying about Fire Force, though. I haven't watched Fire Force in a while. I just I gave up 13, on it because it's just I not... i just been watching uh... other stuff, so... I did finish Burn the Witch, which I do have a review video coming out for that. That will be on the podcast and on YouTube. Um. So yeah, I'll, be, I'll just leave that for... Because I have a whole episode. I think I, I was like on... an eight-minute review on it. I think I was on either in episode eleven or ten, I'm and I'm just like, 13. this is, this is like dumb. I definitely lost interest. Uh, kind of sucks, but to be fair, I lost interest like three times in the first season. Yeah. So I'll probably pick it up and like binge. Like watch I am it, still but... watching an episode like here or there, but like I just completely like lost interest. I'll, in I'll show. probably binge watch like the second half someday. Uh, right now, I just have way too many shows I've been watching. Well, um, one I need to like. The ones I majorly need to watch are Jujutsu Kaisen, the Imiyashi spinoff, and uh, what she calls it. Standing on her middle life? Uh, life? Yeah, standing on middle life. Um, what about your haiku, though? Oh, I'm already out. I've already seen episode 18. Yeah, what, what's your thoughts? How you liking this haiku season? Oh, it's kind of cool how they're showing the Necromon, uh, the cat team. You think so? Kind of like cool how they show off all the other teams playing. Well, they only show on their team though, which they played a team that you don't really care about. Yeah, it's like a filler team. It was a filler episode. 
by the sounds of it. I do like the video. I I like the episode before this one with uh, like his story about like volleyball, video games, and stuff like. Oh that. yeah, where he just didn't really care. Yeah. Um. It's like, just... It was actually trending on Twitter. I was like, holy shit. Yeah, um, he's like. He's lazy, but like he will, he's constantly thinking about how to win. Yeah, but like a they're... lot of people, like I think he's a pretty big, uh, pretty big fan character. Is that how you say it? Like, yeah, he has a lot of fans. A lot of people like him, which I agree too. I think he's really cool. Um, I guess I think this is only gonna be one match, dude. For uh, uh. God, why can't I think? Man, my brain is not working tonight. No, it's uh, not. Why can't I think of the school? Except the K. The main one. This, yeah, this is the main school. What, what is it? Can I, can I, yeah. I'm not gonna say Connoisseur. Right. I can't. I, I believe it's connoisseur. Why can't I think of it? I've said it many, many, many times. You are thinking of connoisseur, which is the main school? Yes. You know, turn on the play. play. Yeah, is that right? I'm, uh, yeah. I'm losing it. Um, you you have the internet. You could always Google it. Yeah, but I'm too lazy right now. Um, yeah, what what about it? What was I saying? What about the school? I don't know. You you were asking what the school's name was, and then you blanked out again. Yeah, I blanked out. It's gone. The thought process is gone. <laughs> Anyways, you I said I something about that the the connoisseur versus like the twins or whatever, mm-hmm. or the the match they playing. Oh, I, I was saying that I think it's just gonna be one match between those two. I think that's all we're getting this season. I imagine it's only gonna be thirteen episodes because it's like part two of of season four. It's not season five. I think it's just part two of season well, four. Well, every season has had at least like I thought fifteen episodes or twenty five no, episodes. No, season four didn't. Oh no, season three was only ten episodes. Well, technically, season four will have it, but it's part one, part two. Yeah. So I think this is part two, and we only. I think we're only gonna get this match between. Because how many episodes are we? We're like halfway, right? Yeah. So. So I imagine we're gonna like finish this one because they've only won the first set, right? I think I just watched the episode. Yeah, I think they they won the first set, and they're 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 starting set two against the twins. Um, and then the red team is on their bracket side, which we've seen that. So they will play them. So they they will not be the final team because remember we were talking about who would be the final. I, I still think Haiku. they're gonna have to go against the the number one. Like yeah, I th- I'm thinking too. Now uh, that the red team is on the same bracket side, the, they have to beat the them spiker dude the always wears the mask because he's kind of a yeah. germaphobe. Yeah. I think who's, I, who's at the training thing where he's like he wasn't really showing what he can actually do. Yeah, yeah, he wasn't even trying there, so he's no. probably ridiculously good. He, he oh yeah, he's the number one spiker. Yeah, and he wasn't even trying district. at the All Star camp thing or whatever you want to say. The Nationals camp. There we go. It was the youth camp thing. Um, I, but I don't know. Are you enjoying this season? I know you're. Big yeah, I mean, I just guy. like I like the show in general. Yeah, um, I think it's better than season four, part one. I'll tell you that because that, that was my least that, favorite. It's all right. It was just most of them doing training camp. Yeah, it was like Deku training. So boring. And then they played a filler team at the end of it. <laughs> uh, what's wrong with filler teams? Uh, it's just like what? Well, you already know what's gonna happen. Like, I know it's. Yeah. It's the same with the red team playing against the same I'm like, well bunch of nobodies, so <laughs> I'm I'm waiting for the bigger man. I mean I'm I'm happy that uh they're playing against the twins right now for it's like, okay, we know that guy is a really good setter. Why was it the nerd guy though at the Nationals? Did he just decline or something? Or what nerd guy? The the setter for the Nekomo, Nekomo, was that his? the red team? He was there for nationals. Yeah, he's he doing like camp? the. Oh no! He, yeah, he, he wasn't there. He it's because they're only invited like the top players of each school, 
yeah, they had the the like, setter or the spiker from I feel their like team there. Pretty decent though, like right? I think he's pretty good. That's, I'd say he's good, but like I'd still say uh, probably. I guess he's probably not. You're not just setter. The other guy was way well. The twin guy's way better, and then yeah, I guess he's still he's probably he might be what maybe top five, top ten setter in the league. I think he's like top five. One of those. Because you have the twin guy. You have. Well, I can't think of his name for for Arsenal. Uh, what's his name? The setter for their Crossano. Who's the setter? Hinata's boy there. Who is it? Kagame? Kagame? Yeah, Kagame. Is that, is that how you say it? Kagame. Which he's definitely up there. And I think there was another setter nationals there. I mean, he's probably top five, top ten for sure. For sure. Um, yeah, it's Kagame. Yeah. I, I just kind of I was thinking about that. I was like, eh. But yeah, there's probably a few ahead of him for sure. I still want to see the the one dude from the training camp. The the people that are calling him the little giant, the, oh, the yeah. short guy with the white hair with the weird owl eyes, as I call him. I don't. I want to see him play again. I imagine. I don't know who's who are they gonna play next. Awesome. I don't know. They first had to beat the Dude, whatever they're twins. They're gonna beat the twins. All right, we already know. Doubtful. No, we already know they're gonna beat the twins. They're going to the finals. <laughs> I don't know if they'll win the finals, but they're going to the finals at least. I think it's just gonna go back to the old like junkyard battle between the the cat team and their team. Yeah, I mean. But I don't think that's the next match because no, it's not. No, they, the next match is going to be the the main team, you know, and them versus the twins for the second set. No, 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 no. After the twins, uh, it's probably. Do you think it'd be the white hair guy, the little giant guy? Either and that, or it'd be it the will one... be red team, and then after red team, they'll fight. They'll play against the fight. They'll fight. Uh, they'll play I, against I think the, the they'll dude. play against the the one spike dude. That's the last dude match. The, no, the the white haired guy that that's a spiker for the think, one team. You think it's be a filler will... team after the after the twins though? <sighs> I don't think it's gonna be a filler team. No, I think they're gonna end up playing the one guy who uh who's one of the spikers at the youth camp that like he gets really depressed if he doesn't get a spike past people and like he eventually keeps like messing up. Who's that? Until they have to uh the What does he look like? I forget what he looks like. Or... What's he look like, man? I don't remember what his he's name at is. Nationals? Yeah, he's the one other dude with the white hair, the taller one that's a spiker. I don't remember. I don't remember who that guy is. All right, Haiku National. Oh, here he is. This, this guy. Hang on, I'm going to send you the picture uh... of him. Characters. Right, I'm looking. I forget his name, but this dude. Uh, this guy. I can't remember his name. I think they might I, end up playing his say, team. Can I look? If, even if I'm on. Oh yeah, that guy. Eh, they could play him. Because he he gets really he depressed in after. Nationals, though. They could play just... him. They could play him or. He's going to be part of a team that loses to, like, one of the better big teams. You know what I mean? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. But, yeah, he could be right on that, though. That could be the next team that they play. But I don't know. Because he's, like, number four <sighs> for Spiker. I think yeah, he's but like he's, he's, he's kind of funny how, like, if he keeps messing up, he just gets, like, really depressed and just yeah. starts being really bad. And they have to, like, hype him back up. Yeah. Um. All right, that's all I got for Haikyuu. Like, do you have any other ones you watched? Did you finish? Mushishi? Uh, no. I I I got on to like the second part. Are you in season two though? Yeah, I'm on like season two, like episode one of Mushishi. Oh, okay. We well, finished season I, one though. Yeah, I I enjoyed it. It, it kind of felt like a miniature like Studio Ghibli movie to me. Yeah, it, it's got that <laughs> chill feel. Like, I didn't sure. want to stop. Like, you're like, hey, dude, you should watch this episode. No, it is Mushishi time. Yeah. I binge watched all 26 episodes, but I, 
Yeah. I really hate how Crunch or not uh, not Crunchyroll Funimation's like, hey, if you want to watch this second season, you're gonna have to pay for it. And it's like, why? Yeah. To um, me, that's that's really stupid. Like, hey, they they're a business man. You gotta get money. Um, but yeah, no, I I kind of figured you'd really enjoy uh, Mushishi. I was tempted to buy Let's the entire vibe. season. Yeah. I might buy the entire season on Amazon. My, uh, my wife's has got the first season. She's watched it a few times. This is very chill, dude. It's a chill anime. It's, you know, taking care of spirits. Um, try to think. Oh, I've been watching. Well, Golden Kamui has been really good. I really enjoy Golden Kamui. It is just an absolutely ridiculous show. I just God, they actually made that. a live action movie. Huh? They made a live action movie of, of this. What? Mushishi? Mushishi. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. I was going to so say Golden I, Kamui. I was like, oh, God. I don't know if Golden Kamui no. should be a, a real life. No, I uh, meant, just, I meant Mushishi. Uh, yeah, uh, I had the option of almost getting the, the. I almost bought the Tokyo Ghoul live action movie at Walmart. Oh, I still don't watch that yet. Is it worse? Because like, I, I know there's only a awesome. small handful of like ones that are like good. Yeah, I, I don't know if that one was good or not. I'm not sure. I was thinking of Death Note there for a second though, but uh, no. my brain's not working today. Uh, but yeah, Golden Kamui. Work? I don't know if anyone uh, in chat or you guys are listening to this podcast or watching on YouTube definitely watch Golden Kamui. It's it's great. It's great. It is. It's got some weird comedy in it. Not weird, but like, it's just a ridiculous show. Like, over the top on some things. <laughs> but it's great. It's great. Uh, very much enjoying season two. I gotta watch the new episode tonight, so. Uh, very excited to watch that. I'm trying to think if there's another show that I've been watching. Oh, uh, the Noble, Noblest. Noblest. I've been watching Noblest. Um, so now with the weird dude that like got revived and like guy. Frankenstein. Yeah, it's vamp- vampire dude and Frankenstein. Yeah, uh, I've only and... seen like the part where uh, Frankenstein obliterates someone because his so-called master led him to like break his seal of some sort. That's all I've seen of that anime. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, it's just like the, the noblest are they kind of like they've been ruling over humans <laughs> and. <laughs> Yeah, they're kind of like they're like like these kings where like they've been protected humans and stuff like that, but like now they're there's humans making like mutations of themselves to become stronger. So pretty much like mutants, like X Men mutants, you know, they're like trying to get abilities cue, and stuff. Cue the music so that they can fight. I don't know if it's so they they can fight the noblest, but like just and the noblest is like no, that's not right. Like humans should not be doing this. So you know, it's kind of like that. That's like the small. I would say it is a decent show. It's not. I don't know if it's at the good. Like, it's to me, it's like a six out of ten right now. Like, I'm not like super. Like, it, it's got my attention, but it's like lower on my list, kind of thing. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'll keep watching it. Just like it's not. It's not where I like want to stop or anything. Like, it's just like. It's like the lower tier on my list right now of things I'm watching. Um. Oh, the other one I'm forgetting. Is it Wrong the Paper Girl in the Dungeon? Season 3. I have it's not good. seen any of that. I like it a lot. It's way better than Season 2. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Uh, a lot of stuff going on. Very interesting stuff. Um, with The whole monster thing. And yeah, I'm I'm really excited for Season 3 right now. I'll be very vague about it. Because there's there's a lot going on in that. Very good though. I I'm actually really enjoying season three, so it's bringing my advice. Because like season two, I was like, ah, oh, I don't know. I mean, the ending of season two got better, but the first half was meh. That's kind of a meh season two. Season three. Get back yeah, because it's like going to the dungeon they... finally. We're going to the tower more. But there's some yeah, because isn't most of the like f- like Bell or something found like a demon girl and like brought her yep. back to like. Yep, there's uh, something very interesting going on in the tower. And actually, the last episode of the show was going down. So, 
Let's last thing I saw because of just random videos that are recommended me on YouTube, just like apparently a lot of the or spoilers by the way. Apparently like a lot of the, the monsters are like living together. Yeah, in a way. Cause like in, there's like some sort of like lizard dude and like Bell like full on like punched him on the head or something. Yeah. And they're like um Yeah Living in Harmony or something. Like they weren't like fighting them. There's something going on with the monsters, and then they're, we don't know exactly what, but they're having the ability to talk, and um, pretty much they, they have like intelligence and stuff, and they don't know what's exactly going on. I don't think, we, I don't even think we know yet right now for the series. But then there's a there's a god there's a god that does know that's talking with their goddess. And he's kind of like learning about like what happens when they kill monsters that the monster life kind of goes back into the dungeon kind of thing. Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff going on right now. It's kind of hard to explain, but yes, it's good. I what season three is good. Well worth watching. Yeah. Um. Is there any other show that? I'm missing. I'm trying to think of my schedule. Like, I have like all my shows when they come out each day. Oh, we haven't talked to any One Piece. One Piece is very interesting. Uh, uh, that, that was a good episode. Yeah, it was really good. I like the uh, what the hell's his name there? Uh, the little it's not a turtle, dude. What is it? Oh, Kappa? it's a Kappa. Kappa. I like the Kappa guy. It's a weird like Japanese demon thing. Yeah, he's really cool though. I like him. <laughs> Wano's best sumo wrestler and like his weird own Kappa style as he calls that means it. Luffy's probably gonna sumo wrestle him, right? Maybe. Probably. I, I th then the the weird plot twist of the the one the <laughs> one character. No, I the boy. Like I I am like what? This is some sort of hi, uh, Dude, Haku type. I don't of know if nonsense. you watch Fate Apocrypha, but that that happens in that. It's the same thing in this one. Um, but yeah, but, but I was gonna say her mask is badass, but it's a he, uh, his mask yeah, is the, badass. Yeah, the whole Haku type of thing from Naruto. Yeah, um, the demon face mask is really cool. The, the old man, though, when he got a sword finally. Yeah, I thought that old man was gonna die. Oh, I thought he did. He got, it just debated us, man. <laughs> long as you wait, you look. <laughs> no, we get you. I mean, he's part of the nine, so I guess I should have not got debated by that. But yeah, was he part of the nine? I thought yeah, he was just like. No, oh, part I of the didn't. Nine. Yeah, when they did the whole like group pose thing, he was part of the nine. Oh. Um. Yeah, man. I want to see. I want to see what, what Big Mom and Kaido do. Like, what can Big I Mom think break they're out? gonna do? I don't think they're. Well, I think Kaido's just gonna throw her around, but I think Big Mom might break out, and there might be Can some shindig. Big Mom break out of the chains? She's that strong. Well, they are sea stones, so I... They I, are sea stones, but I wonder if she can break them. It's like physical strength wise. I mean, maybe? she's getting weakened because she has a devil fruit, but like... She's like, physically strength wise is like, ridiculous? I don't know. I'm kind of curious. I, I'm presuming because of like... If she can take a full headbutt on her head and be like, hey, I remember everything, and then finally get knocked out, I think she can probably just break the chains without with, with trying. I think so, too. I mean, it's Big Mom. But I don't know, like, what, oh. what's Kaido going to do? No, no, no I'm seeing can't... more of the, well, they're, they're called dragon, dragon fruits in this show, but I, now that I'm seeing more dinosaur-like type Zoas, I kind of want one more. Yeah. Just, just, Extreme. Let's... Oh, so dude, I, I got debated too, because I thought, you know how, like, Zoro passes that one guy? Oh. I thought it was Law, dude. I thought it was that, the same uh, bucket head thing. I thought it was Law. That's why would some, Law like, be playing a, a, a pan flute thing? I don't know, man. He's in camo, dude. He's just... Law's too busy fighting Hawkins. No, I think he got out of there, right? Or we don't know. I don't know. They they just, he, he cut himself. And it or, one of or the... Or they have Law. Law just turned himself in. Probably. And then... But Hawking's kind of played dirty because he's kind of a coward. Dude, Law's going to die, dude. 
But I'm he's one of the characters I like. Yeah, but he's gonna die because he, Law is screwed. Either way, unless Hawkins is like, "Yo, I want to be a cool character again, so I'm gonna go join the good side," because that's what I'm hoping for. Because I liked Hawkins until now. Until he joined with Kaido, I wasn't happy. I wasn't happy with Hawkins. So I'm hoping he comes. I think back he made like side. a weird speech where, like, in the law of the land of water, you either become powerful or you stay weak and die. Well, hopefully Luffy kicks some ass and uh, Hawkins is like, yo, I ain't going to. But I don't know. I could see Law dying, dude. I feel like I mean, some if we're gonna have a big pirate war, there's gotta be people that are gonna die. I mean, look at Marine Ford. All right, we got a, like a decent amount of people dead in Marine Ford. So, I could totally see a lot of people dying in Wano. Not a lot, but, like, definitely a few. I mean, we already got one, technically. But I could see definitely more. Like, there, there's someone big that's going to... If if it's going to be a big three-emperor battle, three, between, like, Luffy, Big Mom, and Kaido... Oh, yeah, I forget they someone, called... Someone is going out. I forget, it's like, they didn't they, like, say in, like, the papers that they called Luffy maybe the new emperor? One of the yeah, new, that was, uh, yeah, that was before Wano. That was the fifth emperor. Yeah, that, that was happened before Wano. It was after Big Mom arc. After what he did with Big Mom's place. Oh, yeah, at the wedding. Yeah, they already confirmed that. That was after Big Mom arc between Wano and Big Mom arc. Oh. Um, but yeah, no, I, I totally... Someone will die. I, I think it might be Law. Usopp. Uh, no, I don't think Usopp will die yet. Usopp's later. He's in the final arc he dies, because he wants to be a brave warrior. This has been my prediction for years. I honestly thought Usopp was going to be like the only crew member of the Straw Hats to die, because he's pretty useless. Oh. Oh. No, yeah, I, think, I, think, I think Luffy will die. Well, yeah, he, if he keeps using Gear 4 like he does... I mean, he'll become king of the pirates, but I think he'll die at like at like a younger age. Like I don't think he'll. It's like Goldie Roger. I don't know how old Goldie Roger was, but I he's look like he's in his like thirties or forties. Just because the way Luffy has used his abilities, and because I thought uh, uh Rayleigh really said every time he uses like the fourth gear, it, like takes like ten years off his life. No, he lost ten years right twice. I think actually. I mean, it's 10 years total. I can't remember. It's when Ivan Cove did the adrenaline thing to him. Did it to him twice. I can't remember how many years it is for each time. But I know it's at least 10 years or more out of his life. Yeah, because remember he got poisoned and impelled down. Oh, yeah. He got the, the, the adrenaline thing. And then he got destroyed by the admirals in Marine Ford. And he was screaming at Ivan Cove to do it again so he could save his brother. Yep. Did it twice. Just so you know. So Luffy's lost a lot of his life trying to get through where getting to his dream. I, I think he's gonna like die before he gets <laughs> No, he'll get it to it. Well, every time he uses fourth gear he loses like time on his lifespan. Well yeah, he can only use it for a certain time, but I he'll get to it. He'll get to his dream. I don't know. We'll probably still be I, dead before the I think he'll get to his dream, but I don't think he'll be there for that long. But the world will be in a way better place because he pretty much he's probably gonna like free the world pretty much. All the shit that's going on, the way the whole government thing is, the world government and marine, and the marines, and whatever the hidden past thing is. I don't know, man. There's still so many questions I have for One Piece. Um, so. That we don't know. I, we I'm don't still know. presuming that there's going to be a fight on Kaido's Island between him and Big Mom. Who? Huh? Luffy? No, like, well, besides those guys showing up, I think... Oh, like Kaido and Big Mom? Yeah. Fighting? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. For sure. Because I, I think eventually the, 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 the kitties, Big Mom's pirates, are going to get up the waterfall, and shit's going to happen. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I mean, they might be there already, we just don't know. Well, I think they still have a uh, king, the weird pterodactyl guy, like still watching the waterfall. Well, yeah, but like they're not gonna leave Big Mom there by herself. I imagine they're coming up and no. ready to join. 
or somehow they get to the Kaido Island to go save Big Mom and there's a big <laughs> fight on the Kaido, you know, like Kaido's spot there. That's not. Yeah, and Mark he's gonna yet. have to call back all his like beast pirates to Unless actually like. That's where Big Mom's crew goes to. That could definitely happen. It's possible. I don't know. I don't read the manga or anything, so I have no idea what's going up. I'm just taking guessing that, that, that there's just going to be a giant baller and blitz pretty soon. Oh, for sure. I mean, it's building up to that. This is like the pirate war, pretty much, because the only other emperor is Shanks. And I, I think Luffy will have like a one on one duel with Shanks. I don't think so that's going to end well for him. Well, it's just. Because it's, it, it, it's, I don't know if we'll have like a true, true one-on-one, -on -one, but it's going to be like, are you strong enough to have the pirate hat kind of thing? Because he made a mission for the straw hat. He gave the straw hat to Luffy. So, because Mary said, bring that hat back when you become a, uh, was it like a true pirate? Pretty much. Yeah. So, I imagine we'll get something like that, but I don't know. Maybe Shanks might get mixed into this arc. I don't know. There's like a thousand ways it could go. I don't know. Or Shanks is going to be fighting Blackbeard. Might be part of that arc thing. I still think sure. Shanks wants revenge on Blackbeard for think... the shit that happened. Yeah. Or with the scars. I think Shanks could die too. Just saying. I mean, he's already died on arm. And uh, Luffy will go berserk. Again. <laughs> I don't know. I, like, I, I just, I'd be really sad though if Law dies. I'd be really sad if it, I think he kind of went with the If you had to bet one person that will die box in the Wano arc, who would it be? Like someone that you like. Cuz someone has to be sacrificed. Probably I think it's Hawkins. a bigger I think it's a bigger character than you think. No, uh, not, on the good side. Oh, on the good side. Uh, lose, like cuz like in Big Mom arc we lost like Pedro. Like, he wasn't like huge, but he was decent. This one I think would be yeah. much bigger because this is between a few emperors. This is a bit. This is almost. This could I be. I think Marine we might Ford lose part Law two. actually. Either Law or one of the Straw Hats might actually like sacrifice themselves. I don't know, man. It'd be kind of crazy. Like, what if like, what if like Usopp died or something? And this is when Luffy just like goes. Beyond. Well, I mean, you see how how crazy he went when you thought they died the first time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm wondering if like Luffy will just like unlock. It's like his actual I, awakening of his fruit. So I don't know, whatever it is, the next like year. He, he still hasn't even, he hasn't even done that yet. Because if he actually lost one of his friends from the Strong Hats, I mean, even Law, Law would be a big, big enough like impact to like uh, to like go to like the next stage, like where he just loses it, like a berserk mode. So. It could be impossible that Zoro, because he's been taking no, a lot of hits Zoro, lately. Zoro ain't gonna die, dude. Zoro's yeah. gonna beat Kaido. Come on now. Doubtful. If Zoro Look. dies, I'm done with One Piece. You're done. You quit. <laughs> no, I, I can actually see Sanji be dying because be he's been upset. like. No, like, all I could see is like one of the one. The, I don't see any Straw Hats dying. Actually, no. I could see Black actually uh one of the the nine like. The samurai people dying. Oh, I can see that too, but I think like this the, would be much bigger. Kinimon, the, the, the dude with the weird, like, yeah. hey, put a rock on your head and you make you, like a disguise. I think yeah, he might die. I, I could see that. I could see Dogstorm and the cat guy dying. I, I feel like there'd be a few deaths. I think the biggest. And I could though, probably see the old guy and then the Kappa dude dying as well. Oh, I, I think the biggest death, though, that the one that'd be probably the most shocking and the most impact would be Law. In yeah. Wano. I think that would be the biggest. I don't think a straw hat will die in this arc. I, I think if we were going to have a straw I, I hat think it's death, mostly it'd be between be Blackbeard like, or the Marines. That would be the time. I, I think it's going to be either one of the nine samurais that's going to perish or like Law. Yeah. Well, I could see part of the nine guys for sure dying or like some of the samurai guys. But I think the biggest one would be Law. At least on my book. Law's, Law, maybe his crew. And they do like a huge execution and like. Well, I mean, Law could really just ruin himself out of there. But... Would you cry if Law died? Yeah, because I like him as a character. <laughs> yeah. Well, not cry, but like. I don't know. I, man. I like. I would probably have I... a tear for sure. It'd be definitely. Well, cause... I I'm actually surprised he cares about his crew, which is the weird thing because no, he, he normally never cared. Crew, dude. Yeah, no, he always cared about. Crew. 
He's pretty loyal to his crew. For um, now. no, I'd be. I I would definitely probably shed a tear for Law. Because you know, One Piece. When One Piece <laughs> wants to be sad, it's sad. Like they go like full and like music. Let's it just it, it just gets more sad. <laughs> sad sad probably, music on top of sad music of yeah. flashbacks. Yeah, I probably. Uh, yeah. Cue cue the Naruto swing and sad music. Oh, the yeah. goddamn swing had more time than most characters. Yeah, I mean kids there too. I mean, could kid die too? I think. Kid, like I think, uh, killer. Himself cause of killer. I, I, I think know. killer might sacrifice himself because he that doesn't want to sit there with his laugh anymore. True, 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 true. I keep forgetting. I could see. There. Yeah, I keep forgetting that he has one arm. Yeah, because I always thought he had. Uh, he always had his his left arm with like a metal like. Yeah, he does. Well, he think of weapons over. Metal, it's just, he's and then he's like, "Hey, whatever your arms like, I lost this to Kaido a long time ago." Or. Yeah. Some, so he had lost his arm in some fight he had. Yeah, it's against Kaido. When he first, he challenged Kaido and he died. Eric, he lost an arm for it. Because remember uh, the Wano rules, like the jail rules, like the first offense is what? Like an, I think it's an arm. Oh, yeah, they first cut off one of your arms. Is like, yeah, death. Your, your legs, good. and then the, the second, or the last so one is I yeah, think death. Kid got the first offense there, so that's why he doesn't have an arm. That's why they cut off his arm. But yeah, no. One Piece has been pretty good. In search of followers, primes, and views. Come on, big followers. Anyways, so yeah. I think that's all I, I got, man. I, I don't get why there's, there's so many of those stupid ass bots on dude, Twitch right now. It's just, it's just the way it goes, dude. I know. I, I, I gave him the hammer, goes. man. The band hammer, dude. Um, Anyways, I think we're over time already. Anyways, yeah, we're no, we're about at the hour mark because we started a little bit later because I, I screwed up. Yeah, you messed up for the first seventeen minutes. I couldn't be heard. Yeah. Um. Anyways, shout out box. Uh, you can find me on Twitch. TV slash the dangerous box. And I'm dangerous still box. setting up my Discord. Playing League of Legends, right? Check out Twitch. Uh, playing League of Legends. Uh, Among Us with friends, and I'm also playing. Uh, Total Warhammer Underworld Online. Currently, I'm trying to get an SSD card so I can stream Sea of Thieves with friends. Uh, so but SSD I've been trying to find card one. Or capture card. Uh, yeah, not SSD. A capture card. Now you can play on your computer, but I don't know how it runs. Uh, or I think there's also a thing where I can just download Twitch on my Xbox and just stream that way. But the quality might be kind of the poo poo. Yeah. But anyways, that is Box. Check them out, guys. Check them out. Uh, I'm Oldish22, your host, your lovely host that gives you all the anime facts. Who's all always not muting, unmuting his guests. Yeah, I just, I mute my guests and I just talk. They don't even know. No. <laughs> don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know. Um... But anyways, yeah, I'm Oldish22. If you guys want to watch uh, my streams at all, I play a lot of Path of Exile. We do crew night where we pick random games that I have you guys pick and you, we play any kind of game, pretty much. Um, but just a heads up, a lot of POE coming. I got the old man to play League of Legends. It was yeah. wonderful. Yeah, it was fun. I actually had a lot of fun. Um, I've been playing a lot of POE, though, because I have a race coming up and I have to get ready for it. Um, oh, you're actually doing that race? Huh? I said, no, you are actually doing that race this time? Yes, I am for sure. I, I even bought a shirt, so I'm going to <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Put a shirt on. Yeah, because it's, uh, cr- it's for supporting it. They're, they're crowdfunding. Um, oh, nice. Anyways, so we'll talk about that later. Um, but anyways, yeah, a lot of PoE. If you like PoE, if you want to come talk some anime, I'd love to talk anime with you. Um, I can't wait to talk next week about more anime. Uh, we'll see which each episode's. Hopefully, Box watches a couple more. I will try to get a few guests. I'm going to try to get a couple I've been new trying guests. To. But luckily, uh, I'll have the weekends off now, so I can actually sit down and watch it. Yeah, my, my goal for next week is uh, I'm going to try to get a new guest on. I just going to see um, if they can get on here. We'll see. We'll see. And, uh, yeah, we'll talk some more anime next week. And you can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, uh, YouTube. YouTube, I have bonus episodes of this show where I do anime reviews. When I completely finish an anime, I do a overall review of the season. 
or show, whatever it is, uh, which is on this podcast as well, which you can, if you could rate, subscribe, whatever you got to do, I appreciate it. I really, really do. And.